Hello friends of Golf Course Quality Fertilizer. We got another animal this season uh, that's been attacking us and I've seen this in a few lawns so far. Um, and what it is is uh, melting out or pythium. And so uh, this is kind of a rare disease that we get in our lawn. Uh, it only happens when it gets really warm and stays warm in the 70s at night uh, and we have lots of moisture with it. It actually is a, a a waterborne fungus so it has to have water to be around um, it looks like it kills it dead now this one is you know this was active probably a little while ago maybe two weeks ago or something like that or a week ago and you can see it's a real defined line around it and it just looks dead and it shows up really quickly so it might only be you know overnight or a couple days and then all of a sudden it just looks, looks like it's dying and you're watering enough and all that and well water actually keeps it active and keeps it running now what's nice um, in a home lawn situation in a lot of cases um, we'll see that it kills it on the top but it doesn't kill it all the way so we can look down in here and actually see quite a bit of grass growing back um, and things like that and so it's not dead it will recover itself but it definitely looks ugly and scary especially how quickly it happens and there's nothing we can really do about this I mean there's fungicides out there that cost an arm and a leg to treat it but most times you just have to grin and bear it through summers like this where it's hot and lots of moisture involved and then what we do is if we have to if it does kill it then just you know throw some seed in the middle of august beginning of september and start to recover that area uh, remember that's the best time to seed so any seeding areas that you need you'll want to do it in that time period or at least in the month of september somewhere uh, if you have to in october you have to but Oct september is definitely the most ideal month to seed and so if we look down in here we see lots of good grass starting to grow back finally and so it's just a temporary scenario or situation. It could happen again this summer. We've got some rain coming today. Today is uh, Wednesday, no, Tuesday. Um, and we're supposed to have rain tonight. And then we're supposed to have lots of uh, hot weather following in the upper 90s or lower to middle 90s and, and have warm nights as well. So don't be surprised to see more of this to happen. Uh, you will see it in low line areas, areas that hold water more. Uh, sometimes you'll see it kind of run and follow water because it actually does physically move. It's got a whipping tail, this fungus does, which is kind of strange. It's the only one like that where it will actually whip and move with water and inoculate another part of the plant. So this is Pythium. Don't get too scared. It's just a home lawn. Grass is, seed is cheap but it definitely does not look good when everything else is looking good and then we got this big dead spot uh, that happens within a very short time period. All right, thank you very much.